Um, hi, and welcome back. So in this video, I'm going to answer this question. Did you ever use Khan Academy to help you overcome collegiate hurdles, such as an entrance exam or a course or a regular final exam for a course? Uh, the answer for this is absolutely uh, yes. Um, you know, I use Khan Academy uh, to help me prepare, and there are, I guess, a number of different answers to this. I guess the first answer... <coughs> You know, it's kind of the most overarching answer. I know I've covered this before in uh, other videos, but, you know, I used Khan Academy for about three years to help me prepare, for about three years uh, to prepare, to prepare to go back to, to school. Um, you know, I kind of knew what courses I'd see when I, would, when I would go back, and I figured, you know, if I could get a jump on that, that it would make going back much, uh, much easier. Um... And uh, I guess the second way that I, you know, used Khan Academy to help me overcome collegiate hurdles was, um, you know, while I was actually in school, I would use it to review. I would use it to uh, review. Uh, while I was going through Khan Academy, I took notes, so I would go over my notes. I would also go back through videos and, <coughs> and review concepts, so I would use it to review or to study. And, um, you know, I would use it uh, sometimes to review or study for exams, but, you know, I, uh, in particular for calculus and physics, um, I really tried to, and, you know, I wasn't always successful, but I really tried to use it to review or to study as soon as I encountered something that I didn't quite understand uh, in, in the class. So, you know, I used it to uh, review or study. Um, as far as an entrance exam, uh, I didn't necessarily, I, I did have to take an entrance exam when I started school. I didn't necessarily use it to prepare for that entrance exam. I, you know, I had been using it to just kind of generally prepare to go back to school, um, but I had not specifically been using it to uh, prepare for an entrance exam. Uh, even though <coughs> I think the entrance exam you know, basically went, went fine. So, uh, um, I guess that's my answer. One thing that I would say that I think, uh, did help me or that I think is kind of, you know, one thing I would address given this question is that I think it's much easier or, or it can make your time in college much, much, much more enjoyable. And you can be, I think, much more uh, successful if you're able to give yourself maybe not three years, but some time to prepare yourself before you actually go back to school. Um, <clears throat> you know, I, I tutor some people at school, and, uh, you know, the, I think that people can be, you know, there are all different ways that I think people can be successful in school, but I think it can be, if, if you are uh, really having a difficult time in college or in a calculus class or in a physics class, I think that can sometimes indicate that you uh, don't have a very good uh, mastery of stuff that came before that physics class. And specifically, I think it really indicates uh, most of the time I think the problem is really in algebra. And I think that if you're able to give yourself some amount of time to prepare yourself for going to college, to prepare yourself for entering, uh, entering college, uh, and if you use that time wisely, I think it can really help you be successful. You know, I did use Khan Academy while I was in school, uh, and it did help me while I was in school. But, you know, the time that I spent before I went back to school has really proven to be kind of, you know, the, the most valuable uh, uh, time that I've spent using, uh, using Khan Academy. So anyway, uh, that's my answer. Uh, thanks for watching.